last on the card. Everyone else just be ready, please. Light standing out like the proverbial beacon. And they're racing. One short, it comes natural with the first of them to leave. Ribbon of gold gathering speed. Three secrets going up there right on pace early in a mad charge. And coming over now is Count to Mozov soon after the start. Well, it's rushing forward, Count to Mozov. And this is in unfamiliar territory. Leading three secrets, it comes natural. Back there running fourth is one short being followed. Then on the rails at the head of the others, Star Glitter. On its outside, next of all, when they get going, then is Ribbon of Gold. A length away, double the pro, and then came Classic Pro, which is posted wide. Grey Wolves over near the fence. Uptown Funk Pass, a hero between horses behind those. False statement back in the second half of the field. So is Crystal Dane gonna go. Wanna be good second last. And Abbey Lane is back there at the tail end of the field. They straighten for home by the 400. Heading right out to the middle of the track. This leader snuck a length and a half. Count to Mozov. Running second, three secrets. One short, double the pro down the outside. Classic Pro, false statement. Abbey Lane runs on as well. Double the pro reaches the lead. One short got to second over towards the inside. Down past the 100. Double the pro. One short trying to level up with it. Double the pro with its head in front. They hit the line. Double the pro. Double the pro wins the last over one short. Uh, then count to Moz off third home. Abbey Lane might be fourth in front of Classic Pro. Three secrets. Crystal Dane. Pass a hero. Followed then by false statement. Gonna go. It comes natural. Wanna be good. Never ever got warm. Star Glitter. Uptown Funk well back second last ribbon of gold and whipping them all in in the last is gray wolf number seven's home in the last double the pro ending the day a double there for rona neil irvine the pro art gilding double the pro for mitch pateman luke fernie and has come off a back the back of a northern win last start in a class three and uh, goes to the next level here this afternoon, beating one short. Chris Nickel, Count Tomozov, who led them this afternoon, uh, which is completely out of character there for him. And he's uh, held on for third in the last, and we stand by for fourth. The winner for Neil Irvine. Neil uh, certainly enjoying a, a good latter part of the day with Forgotten Jewel scoring in his silks in race seven. Now double the pro in the last event of Pro Art. Of course, he stands Pro Art at stud. It's out of the second Empire Mare, twice the magic. It's win five out of 29 for double the pro, prepared by Luke Fernie, ridden by Mitchell Pateman. Number 10, one short, a snippet son, Blue Marju gilding, Steve Wolf, Chris Nichols second in, and five count to Moz off by Viscount from National Glory, Paul Harvey, David Harrison. Fourth is number 12, Abbey Lane, the grey wideout, and fifth is Classic Pro from uh, Three Secrets. 7, 10, 5, 12, though, that's what they'll be paying on in the last. A short neck, a length and a half. 113.76.35.91 is the sectional there. I'll sign off. Look forward to your company tomorrow from Northam. In the meantime, let's go down to the yard. And here's Brittany Taylor once again to bring us home from Belmont Park. Thanks, Darren. It's a good evening to you as you sign off. I've got Luke Fernie down in the yard after the victory of Double the Pro. And Luke, has this always been a horse that when he was building confidence in Kalgoorlie, you thought you'd be able to take him to town one day and see him win like that? Yeah, he's always shown potential. He's run home in good time. And Dad sort of was of the opinion that when he got to Kel, the track was a little bit too short for him, the straight. And it showed when we took him to Northern last start and obviously today he had a, a lot of time to warm into it and he does finish off quite well. At what stage of the race were you confident? Oh, when Mitchell pushed one out at probably the top of the straight I thought it was going to take a pretty good horse to run him down so he's done a good job today and hopefully he can go on from it from here. And do we just expect to see him say in another fortnight's time and hopefully put a hat-trick of wins together? Yeah well as long as the wheels don't fall off while he's down here I'm pretty happy to keep him here and Hopefully we can get another win out of him. Well, congratulations on today. Thank you, Britt. Luke Fernie, trainer of Double the Pro. A really good uh, victory by him. And Scott, it's a horse that they had through the Kalgoorlie season, built in confidence. We saw him place on so many occasions uh, back in May, April, earlier in the year, and then has been able to come to town win at Northam and then win again today at Belmont. So they've got the horse ticking along really nicely. We do, Britt. I think all of last season he continued to run eye-catching race after eye-catching race. I'll grab Mitch for a bit of a word now. Mitch, the style of Perth racing is probably a lot more suitable for him than the short, sharp Kalgoorlie straight. Yeah, I think that's what's made the difference. I sort of said to Pete last start that um, might be a good idea to leave him here, which he was already going to anyway, but, yeah, it's worked out well. Confidence level 600 from home? Yeah, got into a beautiful spot and got a great run and probably got there a bit soon for him, but, yeah, he was able to hold him off.
Congratulations, Mitchy. Well done. Cheers, mate. Thanks. Double the Pro wins the final race and denies Lindsay Smith the quaddy. Wanna be good? You were right, Scott. Just couldn't quite do it. He's a hard horse to trust and uh, wasn't able to salute in the last with a double the Pro, putting together two wins on the trot, winning the free entry to Belmont Park handicap. That's it from us here at Belmont. Thanks very much for your company for this afternoon's midweek racing. Looking forward to joining you on Saturday for a big card here from Belmont Park. It's a very good evening.